everybody and welcome to the world of Micah. Today we are going to be visiting Magic Kingdom where we're going to be taking a closer look at some of the Halloween treats they have to offer and then I believe we're going to be riding the Haunted Mansion. You guys are going to get to tag along. If you're new here, click that subscribe button. It'll keep you updated with my latest video. If you would like to support my channel, somewhere up here is going to be a link. It'll take you to my Patreon page. The link is also down below. Now, let's take a closer look. We finally made it into the park and it's been a, a rainy day. When we first got here, we had to sit in the car for a hot minute because it was a little too insane to get out, but we finally made it to the most magical place on earth. Are you smiling this time? Uh -huh. I want to make sure Always that <laughs> make sure everybody knows you're having a good time. <laughs> filming me at the beginning of your last video. Oh, well, I know. I normally I know, don't. Because like, they're like, what, is she okay? Did something happen? I'm like, no, I just had, I had no clue. I was, I was focusing on the road. I was <laughs> on the road. <laughs> All right, let's go have some fun. Wow. As we're walking in, the princesses are on the double-decker bus. They're doing a little rainy day parade type thing. All right, last time we were here, it was not this busy. Look at the stroller parking. This looks like a regular day here at Magic Kingdom. And this line right here is stretching all the way around. It's for the carousel. What on earth? And yes, it started raining once again as soon as we got over here. Grabbing the Poor Unfortunate Souls float. They do have the Mickey Sipper and the Peter Pan float here, but this is for the Halloween season only. And this is it. Oh my goodness. There's Coca-Cola in this and Oh, there's all kinds of stuff in this thing. I, I'm afraid it's going to melt, but we're going to head over to Pinocchio's because we have another treat waiting for us there. We had to order on the mobile app, and then we're going to eat them both inside Pinocchio's. It's a rainy mess outside. We made it to Pinocchio's. It almost completely melted. It's like Ursula's crown is slowly going down. Okay, so like I said earlier, this is made up of cream cheese soft serve. Black raspberry syrup, Coca-Cola, and it's topped with her infamous tiara from Ursula. Dude, the black raspberry and Coca-Cola together is so good. I only took a sip because it was about to overflow. Be mindful of that when you get this. In the Florida sun, it starts to expand and the ice cream starts melting and the Coca-Cola starts, you know, rising and it, it, it just was almost a big mess. But nonetheless, we have it. I'm waiting on Abby so we can try this. But the sip I got with the mixture of Coca-Cola and blue raspberry was fantastic. I'm excited to really get a taste of that cream cheese. So this is the poison apple cupcake. I've never had this. Apparently it's been here before, but it is spiced apple cake topped with pecan crunch buttercream. And I'm seeing some kind of like candy thing on the side there. I'm not sure what that is. You guys can see them like little pieces. Looks good. Pecan crunch is missing. Pecan crunch is missing, I guess. Maybe it's on the inside. Trying the poor unfortunate souls. You don't like Coca-Cola, you like Diet Coke. It's interesting because like I thought the cream cheese would be a big deterrent. And I like cream cheese, but I don't know if I like it in my beverage. Yeah. It's pretty good. It was blue raspberry syrup too. Yeah. Yeah. And the tiara's in there too. Yeah. I thought it was the Evil Queen because I asked the cast member, I was like, where's the Evil Queen drink? And she's like, what? <laughs> but the, is that not the Evil Queen's crown? That's the one that Ursula Does wears. Ursula wear? At the very end of the film when she's being attacked. Dang. Yep, and she's sinking. Get some Disney trivia knowledge right yeah, there. Yeah, a little bit of everything in my bite. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. Really? The cream cheese ice cream, it's good. I think I just want a blue raspberry Coke. We unwrapped everything for the most part so you could see <laughs> what it looks like on the inside there. Ooh. Mmm. Oh, yeah. I got a little bit of spice. Let me clean this spoon off here. Oh, got me a fork. Got a little bit of everything. You 
won't like this at all. Oh, stop. Oh my gosh. This is my new favorite thing. That is pure fall. That is a pure fall cupcake. I think my mouth is blue. My tongue is red. Uh, <laughs> you try, because I'm curious. I think it's delicious. I kind of want to get my own. That's like the best, isn't it? That'd be that like a, a good breakfast. That is a spice cake. Like, yeah. It, That's so good. It is the spiciest cake I've ever had. That little little coffee in the morning. That'd be nice. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, this is this is pretty awesome. It's so good. I like that way more than the poor unfortunate souls, but I do need to eat this. Oh don't. Don't? I tried. What is it? It is not good. Really? Yeah. <laughs> oh. I, I thought it was gonna be like white chocolate. Uh-huh. It's like fondant. Oh. I'm gonna try it. Nope. Not for me. It's time for 999 Happy Haunts. right here you can see in the window the headless horseman rides again it's a strawberry dole whip with fanta strawberry served with the headless horseman straw you know it's funny i got that straw the last time we were in california it was during the halloween season so this will be cool we can have two of them maybe i can hang that one on our halloween tree and they serve it here at the sunshine tree terrace i was thinking they were going to serve it at the sleepy hollow refreshments but unfortunately, they're doing the Leota Sipper there. 
So that's pretty much taking up the entire line. So you have to come here to the Sunshine Tree Terrace to get the Headless Horseman rides again. And this is it, look at that. The Headless Horseman rides again. Strawberry Dole Whip with Strawberry Fanta. This is pretty cool. I'm excited. All right, you ready to try it? Yeah. You're gonna get pure Fanta taking the sip. Yeah, yeah. Did you get a spoon? There you go. I wasn't sure what like strawberry Dole Whip would taste like, but it's good. It just tastes like <laughs> tastes like strawberry. Wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Snozberries taste like snozberries. <laughs> Yeah, that's very strawberry. Seems like there's like pieces of strawberry in the ice cream too. It tastes like, like the seeds. Yeah, the um, the fruit bars, yeah. the strawberry fruit bars. It literally just says tastes like that, but just a salsa. Yeah, I think it's good. Yeah, it's pretty delicious. It's definitely different, but it's good. We're just treating this like the headless horseman came to Adventureland. He got tired of Sleepy Hollow. He came here to visit Trader Sam. He got some heads to trade for him. Oh. You know, Trader Sam, because Trader Sam has heads, and the Headless Horseman Keep cuts going. people's heads off, and oh. he's here to right. trade with Trader Sam because he's a trader. And that's, I you, might I add, today, Abby and I did not eat lunch. <laughs> the lunch has been the desserts. Look, when you're an adult, you can do whatever you want. And we said we wanted some Halloween treats at the Magic Kingdom for lunch. So, so we got. So which one's been your favorite? Okay, I I did like the poor and unfortunate soul streak. Um, you know I'm gonna go ahead and say that that was my favorite. The spice. Really? <laughs> the spiced apple cake was really good though. It was it came in as a close second. Yeah. And I I could have done without the headless horseman drink. Yeah, I just and like I it because it came with the headless horseman I honestly figure. I thought I was going to like that one the most, and I think it's because of the headless horseman and like the the significance it means like to us. But like, right? It tasted just like a summer drink. It didn't even taste like a fall drink. Ooh, that would have been really good if what they would have done. But if they would have, I get the red. I know why they went with like a red flavored ice cream. But if they would have done a pumpkin. Mm -hmm. That would have been really good. Yeah. Like a pumpkin ice cream. Yeah. Or a yeah. cider. Yeah. Oh, cider. Apple cider. Cold apple really cider. Good. I totally forgot until after I said it. Same with the twosome. They have a pumpkin milkshake in Cosmic Rays oh. that I forgot about this whole time. So, so Disney is listening to you. They are. I wish I would have thought about that because I would have liked to have tried it, but well, well fall has just started. How yeah, we gotta got something to come back and try. Absolutely. Yeah, this is gonna be all the treats we try today. Mine is gonna be the, the poison apple. That spice cake was so good. Now I did like this strawberry ice cream. It was it was pretty good, but that spiced cake, man, that's so good. If you guys don't know the significance of the Headless Horseman between Abby and I, I proposed in front of the Headless Horseman at Disney's Fort Wilderness Campgrounds on Halloween night a couple of years ago. If you guys wanna watch that video, I'll post the link right up here. That's why there's significance to that. That's one of our all-time favorite Halloween Disney cartoons. We love that one. We watch it you know, every year. We have this whole thing. We have a lot of Headless Horseman stuff in our house. And we just have always been fans of The Legend of Sleepy Hollow by Washington Irving. So when we saw they had a Headless Horseman drink here, we had to try it. I think that's all the treats we're gonna show for today. Do not worry, we're gonna be back very, very soon for some more Halloween fun. Here at the Magic Kingdom, but I think our adventure for today has come to an end, which means it's time to say goodbye. But if you enjoyed today's adventure, please give me a big thumbs up. The thumbs up button's down here somewhere. I'll see you guys tomorrow on a brand new episode of World of Micah. Until then, stay weird, happy haunts. Goodbye.